There's been a lot of new action movies released on Netflix in the last couple of years, but are any of them good enough to crack Netflix's top 10? Welcome back everyone, Matthew here with Cinegold, and today we're going to be taking a look at the top 10 best action movies on Netflix right now. Let's jump right in and take a look at number 10. First up at the number 10 spot is Triple Frontier. It follows five ex-Special Forces operatives who decide to team up in order to rob a South American drug lord. Of course, this being an action movie, things don't go quite according to plan and chaos and violence follows. Triple Frontier is an action thriller and features an all-star cast of actors including Ben Affleck, Oscar Isaac, Pedro Pascal, and Charlie Hunnam. This was a Netflix original but seems good enough to have been a big Hollywood cinematic release. It may not be the type of movie you're still watching 10, 20 years down the road, but it's definitely a solid weekend afternoon watch for action fans. Number 9, The Harder They Fall. An outlaw, Nat Love, discovers that his sworn enemy, Rufus Buck, is being released from prison and gets his gang back together in order to get revenge. Yes, The Harder They Fall is a western, but you don't need to be a fan of westerns in order to get into this action-packed gym. First, it's got an excellent cast highlighted by Idris Elba and Jonathan Majors. Second, it's got style to spare, including an awesome soundtrack that helps to set it apart from other movies in the genre. And third, the action scenes and especially the shootouts are top notch, making this a very cool and exciting overall watch. Number 8, The Old Guard. It follows a group of mercenaries who cannot die, but keep their special ability a secret in order to keep it from being reproduced. But when their secret is exposed, they set out to eliminate the threat. The Old Guard is based on a graphic novel of the same name and is a bit deeper than what you usually see in the action genre. But in an action film, the action scenes are what matters the most, and luckily this film is loaded with great ones. From hand-to-hand -hand martial arts to crazy gun battles, Old Guard's got a lot of elements that blend together to create a pretty unique and entertaining film. At number 7 is Avengement. This movie is about a man who is sent to prison where he is constantly attacked and slowly he evolves into a cold-blooded killer. But when he's finally able to escape, he sets out to get revenge on the people who got him put away in the first place. Avengement stars underrated action star Scott Atkins in one of his best roles ever and is one of the most violent, brutal movies you will find on this list. The film is all about intense and bloody fights and if you're into that kind of thing, Avengement will not leave you disappointed. Unfortunately, it's one of two movies on this list that's not watchable in every region, but as of this recording, you can find it in the US, Canada, and the UK. Number 6, Bahubali 1 and 2. A boy is raised by the people of a tribe, but one day he learns that he is the son of a warrior prince and must go back to his family's kingdom in order to reclaim his legacy. Bahubali 1 and 2 is an Indian action epic that starts off in part 1 called The Beginning and finishes in part 2 called The Conclusion. It's a much grander film than your typical action flick, topping out at 5 plus hours between the two films and is definitely one of the more imaginative action films films you will find. All in all, Bahubali 1 and 2 make for an awesome double dose of action fun. Oh no, thank you. You know what, do you have um, anything sparkling? That's the one. Number five is Bullet Train. It tells the story of an assassin called Ladybug who's taking on a mission aboard the world's fastest train where, in a bit of confusion, finds he must fight some of the world's most deadly assassins. Bullet Train was directed by David Leach, who's also known for directing the first John Wick movie as well as Deadpool 2. This film has a similar mix of action and comedy to Deadpool, making for a very entertaining overall movie. It's fast-paced and gory and topped off with an excellent performance by Brad Pitt. Action fans will surely find a lot to enjoy in Bullet Train. Ah! 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 
At number four is the night comes for us, when an elite assassin decides to turn his back on a life of crime in order to rescue a young girl. An army of gangsters are sent to take him and the girl out. The Night Comes For Us is one of the bloodiest movies on this very bloody list, with some of the most stylish and gory fight scenes of any movie in recent memory. But it's not only about the blood, it's also just an overall thrilling movie with epic martial arts fights that will have your heart pounding from beginning to end. Indonesia is pumping out some of the best action gems of the last 10 years, and The Night Comes For Us is one of the best of these gems that you will find. This is the point in the video where usually I'd ask you to subscribe if you hadn't already, but instead today I want to just say a special thank you to everyone who's already subscribed. You've helped me grow my channel so much in the last couple of years and I'm so thankful and I want to give a special shout out to three people who always take the time out of their day to leave a nice comment. John Sudlow, David J, and Andrea Arturo Giuseppe Grossi. Thanks so much to all of you and now on to number three. Number three, Extraction 1 and 2. These films both follow Tyler Rake, who is a mercenary that takes on jobs to extract or remove people from dangerous situations. The first film is set in Bangladesh, with the sequel being set in snowy Georgia. Both films make up what is definitely the biggest and most popular Netflix original action franchise. Both films star Chris Hemsworth in his best role, not named Thor, and both movies pack crazy stunts, stunning chases, and savage fights into the absolute absolute best must-see action franchise of Netflix. Aim. Shoot. At the number two spot is RRR. It is the fictional story about two real-life Indian revolutionaries who built up a friendship and fought against the British Raj. This movie is one of the most insane, over-the-top action movies you will ever see. Right now, it stands as one of the highest grossing Indian films of all time, and it's an epic three hours of wall-to-wall -wall entertainment. It mixes action with drama, but it's also got so much more action, violence, romance, beautiful special effects, adventure, dancing, humor. It's a huge movie and if you're a big action fan or you've never seen an Indian movie before, you should definitely consider giving RRR a shot. Number one, The Raid 1 and 2. These movies follow Rama, a rookie cop who helps a SWAT team take on an endless wave of criminals in order to take down an infamous drug lord. The Raid 1, also known as The Raid Redemption, is one of the most brutal and amazing action films of the 2000s. The Raid 2 is just as good as the original and brings more of the stylized fights and incredible set pieces that made the first movie such a hit. Both movies together make up one of the best one-two punches of any any action movie franchise and both are two of the very best action movies you will find on Netflix. Which ones are your favorites? Let me know in the comments below and you can click on this video for the top five crime movies on Netflix. That's it for me today everybody. See you soon.